problem is not if we can produce enough food for 9 billion people in 2050. The question is how and where we produce, process and consume it. The problem is not how many chemicals are necessary to produce food. The question is how we can bring back soil fertility to the center of the equation. The problem is not how large farms must be to produce the food we need. The question is how can we support the world's hundreds of millions of smallholder farmers, many of them women, in improving their production sustainably. The problem is not how we can make food cheaper. The question is how we can apply true cost accounting to our food chain. My name is Martin Lancaster. I was trained as a medical doctor and also became an organic farmer 36 years ago. In 1991 I established a small NGO which since then has been working with farmers, agribusinesses and governments in over 30 developing economies to set up sustainable food chains. We need a complete paradigm shift for the future of food and farming. The current system will deplete our natural resources within a few generations. Therefore, fundamental changes are needed on all levels. And yes, food will become more expensive. But at the same time, we will be able to cut the costs caused by the negative side effects of unsustainable production and to increase the quality of life. To realize this, we need a large coalition, including all players of the sustainable food chain, organizations for nature conservation, animal welfare, environment, fair trade, slow food, and scientists. And they need to elaborate the new paradigm to build on the work of ISTAD and TEEP, to involve food corporations in true cost accounting, to set up major pilots in the food chain, to lobby national and international policymakers, to strengthen the approach especially towards women and youth, and to use new media, including the massive online open courses, the MOOCs. And what does it practically mean on the ground? For farmers, soil must become their basis again. They need to work in a water-efficient way, using methods of organic farming, agroecology and ecological intensification. For agri-food businesses, they need to reward sustainability and refuse unsustainability to think of future customers and not of the bargains of this week. For researchers, they must develop new economic models based on natural resources, soil health and true cost accounting. And most important for us as consumers, let us put our values bag in our shopping bag. Let us look around for local, organic and fair trade food, in that way buying not only food, but also health, biodiversity and animal welfare. Let us adapt our diet to the needs of the planet. Let us think of the farmer as a provider of the values we stand for, as the doctor of the future who heals the earth. Thank you.